Hello guys, welcome to our YouTube channel, Login Aid. In today's video, I'm going to guide you guys on how to fix a 403 error on Google Chrome. For that, make sure to watch the video till the end and you'll be able to do it in no time. So, 403 error occurs when the web page or another resource that you're trying to open in your web browser is a resource that you're not allowed to access. It's called a 403 error because that's the HTTP status code for that error. So, the first thing we can do is we can refresh the page and double check the web address. Make sure the web address you've typed down is correct. After that, the second thing we can do is clear the browser caches. For that, go ahead and open your settings. And in the settings, you can see the general option in the first option of third sector. Go ahead and tap on it. After you tap on general, you can see iPhone storage option in the third sector first option. Tap on it. Then here you'll have to scroll down until you find Google Chrome. After you find Google Chrome, go ahead and tap on it. After you tap on it, you'll be redirected to a page something like this. Here, tap on a float app. A floating app will free up storage used by the app but keep its documents and data. So go ahead and tap on a float app on the menu that pops up again. Then within the matter of seconds, your Google Chrome caches will be cleared. Go ahead and tap on reinstall app. And after the app is reinstalled, a float app button will appear instead of reinstall app, which means your app is reinstalled again and the data and documents has been cleared. Now what we can do is we can plug out and plug in the internet source. So these are the ways how you can fix your Google 403 error. So I hope this fixes your 403 error problem. So that's it for the video guys. I hope the video was informative. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Till then, keep watching.